Alright, check it out. In this video, I'll be teaching you how to transfer paint from any two female cans into one another. It's a really easy process and uh, basically designed to fill up a little pocket can such as this uh, little freebie I got. But uh, first off, you can use uh, female cans to male cans, uh, like Painter's Touch and stuff like that, but that doesn't really work as well. Um, I've also seen people use like set cap adapters between cans to uh, get them to work like that. But this is a pretty sure proof method um, and the best way I've found. So uh, you just want to get two needle caps and they can actually be punched together into uh, one kind of cap system. I've seen this tried with like WD-40 uh, like paint cans because uh, just the tips of those have like a straw on it but uh, this is definitely the best method I've uh, found when working with it so uh, basically just pop one into the other and uh, then onto your can um, you can put the one can that you want the paint to go into so in this case the pocket can into like a freezer or something if it has some paint in it so that way it is a lot more low pressure than the other can um, so the paint wants to mix to the right one so basically make sure both cans are well this can doesn't have any paint in it but uh, make sure your can that you're mixing from uh, is all shaken up and uh, once that make sure you uh, screw the tip on really tight make sure it's good to go and then you're gonna want to press down the can you want the paint to go into first I like to put mine on top as well so this one's feeding up into it because if you uh, flip this can over the straw is on the bottom of the can uh, which now doesn't have any paint around it because the paints all settled down so uh, be sure to have this can on top depress the can that you want the paint to go into at first and then the bottom can and I'm not sure if you can hear it but the paint kinda has a drippy kinda sensation I don't know listen for it and so if you hear that you know the paints going in and you just hold it for a little bit I'm using blue paint um, because before I had put some pink in here, and, uh, yeah, so, give it a little bit, I'm not really sure what it feels like once it's full, so I just kind of keep going at it until, you know, I get a good, good sense in there, and then it, uh, kind of pops off, and gets paint a little, little place, but no big deal, take that off, and be sure to spray that out with, um, you know, just another can, uh, to ensure that it's not, um, gonna get clogged up because I've had the stems of those get clogged up pretty easily. So I'm just gonna grab another cap and uh, test this out. So there you have it. You can kind of see that it's definitely not the same color as this exact can. So I'll just throw a cap on this one to show you the kind of difference because you can see I had some other color in there so this can actually work to mix your own paint uh, as well because I had some pink in there and the light blue kind of mixed with the pink to make this a uh, little purple color yeah it works well um, you're not gonna get a ton of tags out of it because it is such a small stipend of paint but it's a nice little free pocket can for sure so uh, if you have any questions leave them in the comments and uh, it's really gonna do it for me